Ty, bite here. That's a nice bluegill. All right, guys, we are using bluegill. Nice, healthy ones. Here you go, Ty, let's put this one in here. We're just using little itty bitty wax worms. Fish on. So yeah, guys, this is what we're using. A lot of bluegill, green sunfish, hybrids in there. Skipjack is pretty hard to find right now, so we're gonna be resorting to these fish as bait. get some of them. These are fun to catch, aren't they? All right, guys, I think we're set. We got plenty of bluegill. And we're now gonna smack some cats. Smack them, boys. Smack, smack them. We are on Chickamauga Lake, right above Chickamauga Dam. We are with the captain, Ty Conkle. Ciao. FVCatfish.com and Billy Claybell with Panfish.net. That's right. We're going to do a couple of live gills, just like that. I like to, when I'm suspend drifting, I like to hook them there because then they swim kind of natural. Looks like you got the snow hook there too. Yep. It's good. So, tails away. It's going to be 24,000 today outflow discharge, okay, so wow. they may bump it up to like 30 something thousand, we'll see. You're like in close to 60 feet. Oh, my Akuma is starting to. I know, I noticed a couple of mine are doing that too. How's it going? Good. Just started. Just started. Yeah. I don't think we've been sitting here three minutes. We'll take a quick look at your license. Get out of your way here. Oh, you're fine. Never mind you guys at all. Here's my license. Second here, I gotta get mine up here on my. Go from around here? Yeah. I'm a teacher up at Signal. Okay. We all use it for bait. Oh, uh, bluegill. be the last one to find it. That's all right. As long as you find it, that's all that matters. Thank you. Fire extinguisher on board? Yes, sir. Right under okay. there. You need to see it? Ty, bite. Here. Yep, there it is. Yep. Yeah, 
based on. You all just fishing for whatever hits. Mostly after blue cats. So. Okay, cool. This one's decent. We got our first cat of the day. Here he comes. You got the grippers. Yep. <laughs> you want to get him, Billy? Decent one. Got some swords on him. Well, thank you, Mr. Conkle. Appreciate you buying all your losses. Open it. Yeah. yeah, we brought a little bit of luck to you. There we go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks, guys. All Thank right. you. First fish in the boat, guys. That's the first time I think I've ever been checked, too, on a boat. First time I've been asked for my fishing license all year. Hmm? I've been asked for everything Here else. you go, Ty. All right, guys, first fish of the day while being checked by TWRA. We're going to go ahead and release this guy. There we goes. All right. Oh, you got a little bit of weight to him. It looks like a pretty good takedown. Yeah, I'll take anything. It's two. That hit the demon dragon. <laughs> <laughs> it did, didn't it? It did. These are the new B&M Silver Cap Magnum poles. I like your shirt, man. <laughs> fish to learn, fish for life. Yeah, it's the lucky shirt. Looks like we got Steve yeah, Douglas. <laughs> Steve Douglas over there. And then TWRA people over there. <laughs> the potty on the river. Steve Douglas is driving by while I'm fighting this catfish. Can't beat that. Oh, he looks like a 20 pounder. Uh, maybe, maybe. I think he's probably 10 or something. Yeah. Ah, he's bigger than 10. He may be pushing 15. Yeah, he's a nice cat. Nice kitty cat. Get that demon dragon. Yep, I hear it rattling. Got him. Eh, a little bit smaller than I thought, but this is a nice fish still. Yep, rattling the demon dragon. That rattle, that rattle really helps. <laughs> Here you go, man. Here's your fish. Nice chickabunga. I'm gonna show that for the camera. I'd say he's. Whoa. I'd say he's close to. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say 13 pounds on that one. What do you think, Ty? Yeah, at least. Yeah. 12. 12 pounds. 12 pounds. Yep. Nice fish, Billy. All right. Let him go, let him grow. Let him go, let him go. Don't hold him in here anymore. Let him go, let him grow. There he goes. And then they'll come for more. How is it? A nice little cat. First time I've got to use these rods. So tell us about the new Silver Cat Magnum rod. Well, they've changed the original one. Uh, the big three things are they've gone from the paracord grip to the cork and gone to a stainless steel reel seat and the solid stainless steel eyes. So no more inserts. Those are the three biggest things. And I think it's a great improvement. Already a good rod, but I think definitely a step up in the right direction. Hit the demon dragon. Shout out to Scott Manning, Tennessee River Monsters. Thanks, Scott, for these little rascals. I owe two fish on this rod so far today. Two out of three on the demon dragon.
may just have to stick another one on. This one has a little bit of shoulders on them, huh? It's hard telling. I don't know. Seems like it's a steady, not a lot it's of, nice. It's a nice not a lot of shaking nice. down there. Yeah. Woo, now he's mad. <laughs> That's a nice one. That one's probably close to 15. Looks like he's wrapped up. I, I got another, somebody else's line in there. Got you. Oh, yeah, he's bigger. Yeah. Nice cat. Yep. He may have broken somebody else's line. Look at the fork whisker. Oh, that's cool. There he is. Nice. Nice 15 pound blue. Let's go ahead and release it. That's beautiful. Good fish. Good fish. Yep, it's a small one. He's kicking too much, but it's a fish. Yep. Fish on. Fish to learn, fish for life. Fish to learn, fish for life. That is a Chat Cat's motto. He's shaking a lot. Uh oh, where's that? You want yours? Sure. You like your red, white, and blue. Beautiful fish. You're good to go. Oh, yeah. Fish on. We are fishing this bluff. Right here. Small one, huh? I don't know. Can't really tell. Yeah. The current making the little ones feel big. Now we can just swing him in, actually. You got it? Yeah. You want to hold him? Your skipjack got bit a minute ago. Oh. There he is. Little bitty blue. All right. What you need to do is grow up to be a hundred pounder. Fish on. We are now at the Sequoia nuclear discharge and Captain Ty Conkle is hooked up. Oh, dad. Oh, Dad. Small one, huh? Yeah. I think you got around that other line. Oh, this one. Yep. Little turd. Ah, oh, so aggravating. It's a blue. Nice job. Yes, he's very pretty. Healthy. Bye-bye. Uh, I don't know, guys. They're trying to use my rod reel and pull a Leo shing off by catching a catfish on my light rod. You got to get straight down. Thanks.
got some shoulders on it, maybe. It's small though, but it's probably like the other ones we caught earlier. Oh, yeah, small one. Still good, the fish. You wanna one? All right. There he is. All right, let's release this bad boy. There he goes. All right, guys, we just got done eating at Aries restaurant right on Chickamauga Lake, and we're gonna go and call quits for today. Pretty slow morning, afternoon bite. Uh, we caught, what, eight fish? I don't remember. It was like eight fish or something. You guys should be able to count in the video. Actually, I wasn't able to get your last one on video, but uh, so it was really great to have you, Billy, coming down to Chattanooga. Really great to see you again. Yeah, and then Ty. Appreciate it. You're welcome. Okay, if you guys haven't checked out their channels, Billy with Panfish and then Ty with FVCatfish.com. Um, if you guys don't know as well, Ty gives people 10% off their trip if uh, you mention my YouTube channel, Chat Cats Fishing. So, as always, guys, give a thumbs up for this video, and we'll see you later.